Hi hi. Martin Green from the United States has written this short story, Appointment in Samara. Henderson, a criminal, had been released earlier from the prison because of this coronavirus pandemic. So later he went to the supermarket in Sacramento. Hold up in a small apartment, he considered schemes to take advantage of this pandemic and then went to the supermarket and scooped up all the toilet paper he could from the supermarket. Suddenly, feeling that someone was looking at him, he glanced up and saw death in the next aisle. Their eyes met and death made a threatening gesture. Henderson immediately abandoned his shopping cart, ran out of the store, jumped into the stolen car and drove as fast as he could to San Francisco. Once he reached San Francisco, Henderson stopped his car and asked a homeless person on the way where he could find an out of the way hotel. The homeless person pointed at the hotel and then held out his hand. But Henderson ignored his plea and drove to the hotel, which almost looked like an abandoned building. The hotel clerk, who although didn't know that he had the virus, gave Henderson the pen he had sneezed on earlier that day to sign in. Back in Sacramento at the supermarket, the checkout clerk asked Death why he had made such a threatening gesture to that other customer. Death said that it wasn't a threatening gesture, but it was a gesture of surprise. He has been surprised to see Henderson in Sacramento because he had an appointment with him later that night in San Francisco at the Hotel Samara. So no matter where you want to go, just don't go. Stay home, stay safe, be safe than sorry. Let's all just save the world by being home. When certain things are to be kept away, it has to be kept away. Last year when I visited my sister's house, her six-year-old daughter came running to me and asked, Auntie, is it true that apples keeps the doctor away? I said, well, yes, that's what they say. She immediately said, then auntie, could you please quickly help me to check if there is an apple at home? Because my ball just broke the window of the doctor uncle in the next door. Hi, hi, just don't go yet. I have something to say. I hope uh, most of you are at home now. Most of us are scared, bored, restless, and um, I know a lot of emotions are going on during this COVID-19 period. Let's all just stay strong, stay safe, and just hope for the best. This shall definitely pass. I'm just uploading some audiobooks for you all to listen during this period when you want to divert your mind. So I've just focused on mystery and suspense genres and I have collected few short stories from other writers which I'm uploading in the YouTube as audiobooks. So do listen to it at leisure or whenever you want to divert your thoughts. And if any of you has the habit of writing stories, you may also send it to me and I shall read your story as well. Or if you have never tried writing a story, now is the best time to explore. Please do subscribe to the YouTube link Shiloh Winston Speeches so you can be updated as and when I upload a new audiobook. Otherwise, just stay safe, all of you. Sending my love to all of you. Take care.